everyone, this is the second day in a row that I'm filming a video and I'm really, really excited about it because I'm on track right now and I hope that I can keep this up because it feels really good to just sit down and film videos for you guys. And it's a beautiful day and it's really starting to feel like summer and I don't know, I'm just really in a good mood right now. It's just a good day so I'm really excited. But today I am filming my top 10 favorite spring nail polishes. So I've done this before. Um, in the fall time, I've done it in the summer before, so these are my favorite spring nail polishes. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Okay, so I believe I do have 10. I didn't actually count, and I just said it was 10. So one, two. Okay, good, I have 10. So the first one, I'm just gonna randomly pick these up from in front of me. These are in no particular order. I don't have one favorite over the other. I like them all the same. The first one, I just mentioned this in my April favorites video. This is the color Tarte Deco by Essie. And it's a beautiful, beautiful, kind of peachy, orangey, creamsicle color. And it's just really, really pretty. I hope you can see, like, the true color. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's a really nice, creamy finish. Um, my, for some reason, I got it all over my bottle. I don't know how that happened. So I'm sorry that's such a mess. I should show you this side. But anyways, I love this color. It's perfect for spring and summer. Um, and it just, I don't know, it's just such a cheerful color. So I really, really like this one a lot. And then another color kind of in the similar family as that. This is Essie's Cute as a Button, which I love that name. I think it's so adorable. But this is more of a pinky coral color, so I can show you those next to each other. Um, they are quite different. But this is a really pretty um, pinky coral color, and it's just so, so pretty. And um, it just, I don't know. I really, really like it a lot. Again, with the creamy texture, the same as that one. I love that kind of finish. Um, so, yeah, I really like this one a lot. And then this one is from OPI, and it's called What's With the Catitude. And I believe this was from, like, the Shrek collection. I'm not really sure, so I don't know if you can still get this. I got it at Ulta last summer, so they still had it then. But it's just a really pretty, like, pale baby blue color. And it's a really unique color that you don't see a lot of companies come out with. I know it doesn't look that special, but when it's on your nails, it looks really, really pretty and unique. I get a lot of compliments when I wear this one. And a similar one, if you can't find this color, this one is from Revlon, and it's the color Blue Lagoon. And it's kind of similar. This one's a little bit darker, but they are very, very close. So, just in case you can't find that one, you can find this at the drugstore. This one has a little bit of some sparkles in it, though, whereas the other one is just a cream. But I really like this one as well. And it's a great cheaper alternative, so that's always nice. And then another color, this is by OPI, and it's the color Do You Lilac It? And I have had this color for years. This is actually my second bottle. I really, really love this color. It's just a really pretty lavender lilac color. Again, with the cream finish, that must be my favorite because all of these are like cream finishes. Um, I love this color a lot. I believe I've mentioned this in videos before. And it's, again, these are just such unique colors. I think it's really, really pretty for spring. It's very um, pastel, and I really, really like it a lot. Now this next one would be great for spring or summer. Um, probably more so for summer, but I really like wearing this on my toenails as of right now. And it's the color Strawberry Margarita by OPI. And it's just a very, very bright pink, but not, it's not too blue of a pink, but it's not too orangey of a pink. It's like the perfect color. And I actually have this on my toes right now, and I love it. Every time, like, I wear white flip-flops or something, it just pops against it, and it looks really, really pretty, and I get a lot of compliments on this color, too. It's just the perfect color for a pedicure, so if you're getting a pedicure or doing your toenails, I would suggest you try out this color. It's absolutely gorgeous, and it looks great on everyone, so I really, really like that. And then if you want to go for more of a springy pink color, this is actually really, really light. It's called Sweetheart by OPI, and it's more of like a milky pink, um, very, very light, but I really like this a lot. It's so clean looking on your nails and very sophisticated, so um, I was wearing this in like my spring outfit of the day, and I got a lot of questions on what color I was wearing, and this was it. I've worn this a lot in my videos, though, before, and I have mentioned it a lot before as well. So I really, really like this a lot, and... This is a great color if you just want that really pretty fresh spring manicure. 
Okay, now these next three colors are very, very similar, and I don't know why I included all of them, but I kind of just had to because they are a little bit different. The first one is what I'm wearing on my nails right now, and I just mentioned this in my favorites video as well. This is Essie Turquoise and Caicos, and as you can see, I have it on my nails. And I really like this. It matches my earrings today, so that's always a plus. Um, I think it's really cute. And I actually, I put this turquoise color like as my eyeliner too. I don't know if you can tell um, from this far away, but I really, really like this color for this time of year. I think it's really pretty. And again, this would be great for summer as well. All of these colors can carry into summer. I just really like the pastel colors for spring and then kind of more bright like hot pinks and reds and oranges for summer. Um, but these will work for either one. Okay, and then this color is a little bit similar to the one I just showed you. It's from Essie as well. I feel like I have a lot of Essie and a lot of OPI, so I'm sorry for that. But this one is called Mint Candy Apple, and it's just a little bit lighter than this one. This would actually be really cute to wear this with it as like an ombre effect. I actually, I might actually do that next time, but it's really, really cute. And it's kind of like a bluish green, but very, very light, if that makes sense. So I like that one a lot. And then this last one is by Revlon, and it's in the color Minted. And they are very, very similar. They probably look the same on camera as they always do. But in person, the Revlon Minted is a little bit more of a minty green color, whereas this one is more of a minty like blue-green color, if that makes sense. This one really has like no blue whatsoever in it. It's just mostly green. So this is really nice as well. And just gives your nails that really pretty peppermint look. And it's just really fresh for spring again. So this was a really quick video. I'm sorry about that. I don't know why I just went through those so fast. At least it feels like it was really fast. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you want, I can do more like nail videos because I know I really don't do much. Um, I have a ton of nail polish. It's kind of insane, and there's no way that I need as much nail polish as I have. It's kind of ridiculous. But um, so if you want any more like nail polish videos, or I can show you guys how to get a really nice manicure. I know how to do manicures really well from when I was in cosmetology, so I can share that with you if you'd like to see that. Um, just let me know. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of quick and easy, but that's all I had to show you, I guess. So I will talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, and make sure to follow me on Twitter because I'm going to start saying that in every video now. I'll have the link in the bottom bar down below. And if you want to show me your favorite spring nail polishes, then go ahead and post them as a video response and I would love to see yours. Okay, I think that's all I had to say. So subscribe to see more videos and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.